Pizza on a geocaching road trip? Yes, please. So I've been geocaching for 16 years, been doing YouTube videos for over 13 years. And would you believe it, with all that time, with all that geocaching, I have not found a geocache in every county in my state. I just subscribed to Cashly Pro, which actually shows you how many counties you've gotten in each state. And I noticed in Southern Minnesota, I was missing count of one, two, three counties. So I had the day off and I thought, what a perfect day. What a perfect opportunity to go and get those counties. The first one is over there. And according to the cache page, it requires a tool. It requires this broom right here. Brush up, brush up, brush up. I'm not exactly sure why I need a broom, but I do. I feel like a chimney sweep with this broom. Chim, chim, and I, chim, chim, and I, chim, chim, cheru. I'm in my first county and I'm in the woods and all there is is a big pole. As you can see, it is a big pole. I put my broom in there. I should have brought a little lighter broom because this isn't really the right kind of broom, but it's this thing is, it's spring loaded. So I can feel the cash. If I let go, I can hear it coming up. This is gonna take a little bit of trial and error and I'm gonna have to put you down to see if I can get this to pop up to jump out, if I can get the geocache to jump out of here. Yes, it certainly took some dexterity. I could have used a partner to help me, but I did get it, got the geocache. Check to this county, a really cool concept on this one. I've seen spring-loaded caches before, but nothing quite like this one. It was tricky, it was tough by myself, but I got it. Oh my gosh, you missed it. I just cached this whole town, and this whole little town had so many good geocaches, but don't worry. You're gonna be able to see them on my short form videos, so make sure you go to my short form feed and you'll see some really cool caches there. But now, I'm off to another county, but first, I must eat some Casey's Pizza and some Casey's Cherry Coke. Not sponsored. The Casey's, if you're listening, pizza. Pizza on a geocaching road trip? Yes, please. I am now in Houston, Minnesota, which is in South Eastern Minnesota, and I'm in front of the International Owl Center today as it's closed. But there's a venture lab, a five-stage adventure lab, all about owls. So I thought that would be a perfect, a perfect geocache to complete for this county. Back there, I have found a wood carving full of owls. I have to answer a question, and then I get a find on the Adventure Lab app. We always say that geocaching takes you to the best places and there's just this cool little playground over here and there's a beautiful owl sculpture over there. But I completed it, I got all the answers, all about owls, I learned a ton about owls and now, now I get to find the final container. I am now in the woods where an owl would be and I spotted something. I spotted the final container. There you are, you beautiful pill bottle. One more county left. You're my second to last county. Cash is all signed and I'm dropping my path tag for the next person. Yes. I am in the final county that I need to get for the whole state of Minnesota. 
and I'm overlooking the beautiful town of Rushford. And in these woods, up on this bluff, is one more cache that I need. I spy my little eye. Peanut butter jar. Skippy, yes! Minnesota County Challenge complete.